Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Candy here today and whoa, is that Candy uploading two days in a row? Oh my god. But yeah, we are back with another episode of the Vanity MC Alcatraz Prison Series and uh, we're getting back on the grind guys. I know, I know, I said I'm going to start uploading and guess what boys, the upload is here. So if you guys haven't seen the last episode, basically I kind of showed off all the stuff that we had and I said that, you know, if we get a couple likes on that video, I'll go ahead and show off the backpacks as well as our really, really nice pickaxe that we have so you know you guys pretty much pulled through and uh, that video did decently well so let's go ahead and start showing off some of the brand new stuff that we have well i can't say it's brand new because we've had it for like a pretty long time now but obviously i haven't shown it off to you guys and i figured to myself well we're kind of hiding a lot of our value and since royal apparently is starting to hide some of his value now because we're hiding some of our value i'm not really gonna have any content if i like don't show you guys anything so i figured out you know what might as well go ahead and show you guys some of the backpacks that we have as as well as the brand new pickaxe that I've been using, which uh, is a really, really, really good pickaxe. Don't worry, like you guys can at least see from this how this pickaxe, along with the backpacks, make around one billion dollars a minute if you guys go and sell, or like if any of the people who use it go and sell every 10 seconds, which is actually possible because uh, I'll show you guys like this pickaxe that we have right here is uh pretty good it's only got 30 million blocks on it but guys it is merchant 3000 that is the max merchant you guys can get it's got haste 5 on it max haste you can get you got speed 2 on it whoa why does it have speed 2 this thing should have like speed 5 on it okay that's whack but it's got explosive level 300 it's got jackhammer 5 i don't know why we have jackhammer 5 on it and then we have Geminator 1 or Gemerator 1, which I think gives us one gem every so many blocks or every so many hours. I'm not really sure how that works. I've never actually seen it and used before. Oh, and we also have Fortune level 700 on it. I totally forgot to tell you guys, but Fortune is like a really, really good enchant. Apparently, the more Fortune you have, like obviously the more blocks you'll get. So like if you guys just go and like break one block right here, you'll get like 700 of these. Not necessarily like 700, but you'll get like a significant more amount of the block here than if it was just like, I don't know, Fortune level 30, which is pretty standard on a regular pickaxe but for a good money pickaxe like yo this is looking pretty good i don't think we're going to be upgrading explosive anymore because we're at the point where we fill up within 10 seconds so no point in beating a dead horse and just upgrading it to the point where we literally just fill up in like one second and we can't do anything else so uh that's the pickaxe right now and let me go ahead and show you guys some of the backpacks that we're using so a lot of you guys have been trying to cut me and saying like not cut me but like you know uh, slander me for saying that I don't tell you guys anything about what my cell is doing I don't show you guys anything but today's the day that changes I've got a really really nice backpack right here it can hold 41,000 blocks on it like I said backpack items are automatically put into your inventory or automatically put into this when your inventory is full and not only that guys not only do we have one level 41,000 backpack but we've got another backpack which is at 40,700 so guys all this time behind the scenes, my cell has just been going along and upgrading a bunch of backpacks. Like, I mean, in comparison to the standard inventory of backpacks, which are literally just like 250 times however many are there, like these one, these two backpacks alone are literally worth like, I don't know, 20, 30, or 100 times the amount that I can hold with a full inventory of regular backpacks. So, uh, cell has been going really, really hard on upgrading those. As you guys can see, I got my blocks up to, I think, like 13 million. So, nowhere close to Royal, nowhere close to Dexter, but, uh, I've started using the money pickaxe and grinding a lot of money as well as grinding some tokens to go ahead and add on to that i actually think yeah we got 296,000 tokens right now so you know we could probably just go ahead hit up another upgrade right now whoa i do not want to buy anything right there let's go upgrade the backpack and let's just toss in a couple more levels so 300,000 there we can just toss some regular ones i know my cell members get really mad but i just literally toss uh levels on this one because they like you know they like to see these flat out 41,000 or like the flat out 4,700 but uh, I just like to, you know, make it as efficient as possible. So we're just going to be looking at it. 40,798 plus 41,000. That's what, like 82,000 or almost 82,000. So that is very, very substantial. Like in comparison to just a regular 250 backpack, that is a lot of money. You know what? I got to show you guys how much money this thing really makes. So as of right now, we're around 6.77 million. Let me just go ahead and pay like I Swiggy, uh, 677, then like 1, 2, 3. I think that's 6.7 million dollars, right? Oh, that's 670,000. Rest in peace. I think we can send him what? 
Uh, I don't know, maybe like six million. Okay, hopefully that should be six million, right? No, that's not six million. Okay, that's six million, and that should pretty much drain our money. We probably might be down to like ninety thousand. Nothing really substantial. All right, guys, I just had some technical difficulties. That's why my balance really just changed to like three point three seven k. I actually just recorded a clip of me like mining, and we didn't even come close to one billion dollars. I'm not gonna tell you guys what we got, but I figured one billion dollars might be a little bit too clickbaity. So we're gonna go ahead and start off the one minute timer right now, and uh, then we're gonna see like how much money we make i also have some technical difficulties with like the vanity mc your backpacks are full message because you guys know that whenever you mine on here like and if your backpacks are full a gui thing will, like pop up on your screen telling you that your backpacks were full but for some reason mine were like telling me it way too early and other times it just like was not showing it to me at all so i really didn't know when my backpacks were full and obviously that is like gonna gonna stop all my efficiency because then i'm gonna have to like go look at my backpack see if they're full and then uh, go fly up all the way out here and if they're not full i'm gonna be like damn i could have been mining so that kind of messed me up but nevertheless we're gonna go start up the timer right now three two one all right there we got the timer going and uh, we're basically just gonna see how much money we can make like within a one minute or within a little bit more than one minute i don't think we're gonna hit one billion dollars but uh i feel like if we had a better pickaxe or like a couple more slots on this backpack i definitely think we'd be able to do it so there we go we got the your backpacks are full sign and we made around 160 million dollars and it's been around 20 seconds so far so i feel like i'm just mining super inefficiently right now i'm like falling into a bunch of holes we've got the vanity mc backpacks are full sign that is another 160 i think that's what 320 million dollars right there and we are around halfway through this so hopefully we can get to maybe like 750 million i feel like that is more reasonable than a whole billion dollars right there like i don't think we're at that level yet so got another backpacks are full sign and boom 160 million dollars right there so we are basically just i don't know farming money right now like this is i mean we're gonna go ahead and like calculate exactly how many beacons and stuff or how many dragon eggs that is and that thing i think that's it we got two more seconds to go might as well stop there that's been one minute to go and you know i guess we could just go and uh sell the rest of this stuff and see how much we're gonna be making so i literally can only sell every 10 seconds that's around another 18 million dollars right there and that brings us to around 600 and 42 million dollars i think if i was mining a little bit more efficient and like if i didn't have a lot of these jackhammer spikes and like these multi-directional spikes just kind of in my way with another cell member mining and if i was out like this vanity plus mine over here which sadly i don't have access to. like look guys i literally can't mine here so uh i would say that you know instead of 660 million we'd probably be able to get i don't know 750 million dollars pretty easily because we wouldn't have to worry about the diamond blocks you'd literally just be getting straight emeralds and then i also wouldn't have to worry about like somebody else aka a uh, Ritz over there messing up my mind when my mining strategy taking all the blocks from me but uh you know 750 million or 660 million it's not really that too far off like you guys know standard deviation and stuff not that bad but uh I'm really really happy because let's go ahead and do some calculation now so let's say a beacon goes for around like 30 million dollars so we got basically 660 million dollars um within one minute right and then let's divide that by around 30 million dollars which is the going price 30 35 million per beacon that's around 22 beacons in one minute like i don't know if you guys understand that is a lot of beacons and if you guys don't know one beacon goes for around i think 2000 cell values so if you go ahead multiply like 22 times 2000 that is around 44,000 cell value within one minute and then Let's go ahead and do some more math. We multiply that by like, I don't know, 60. We can literally get 2.64 million cell value within one hour. I don't know if my math is right on that one, but uh, 2.64 million cell value. If you go ahead and look at the cell top right now, there are some cells here that literally don't even have like 30 million so this is literally what they have around 10 hours of grinding just with our pickaxe and we'd still have more so if i want to go like solo i could get cell top 10 literally just by grinding for 10 hours straight i think that's like super duper op i mean if you guys don't think this pickaxe is op like literally comment it down below tell me what royal has because uh yo i think we have a really really good chance of winning just with this pickaxe and just with these two backpacks that we have i didn't even notice it but uh the ritz you know block top one and apparently we got another guy on block top two so if we go ahead and hit up the slash block top right now we've got ritz over here and then w53 over there and then i think if we go ahead look i ryan over there then we've got she over there uh, a couple other more people let's see swiggy over there so 
So like, look, we literally got the number one, number two, number five. Like, man, we got all the block top spots. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna be up there really soon. I gotta go help out the team. But Aris just paid me 555,000 tokens, which is actually a lot of tokens. Let's go ahead and upgrade one of these backpacks. So the 41,000 one, we might as well just leave that one at 41,000. Uh, we can get this one up to like, you know, 800, and then we can probably add, I think, what is that, 900 levels onto that one. And then I'm gonna just leave it like that because I guarantee you guys, these cell members are gonna get absolutely pissed if I just add like random one slots on them. So we're just gonna leave the rest of those tokens, 4,900 or 40,900, and that'll pretty much bring both of our backpacks almost even. Wait, why is that not full? Okay, never mind. That is like super duper weird. What the hell which just happened? Why is it showing that my backpacks are like not full? If we go ahead and hit the upgrade, and look at that. It's like, wait, never mind, never mind. I think I'm tripping or something. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was like 40,798 versus uh whatever 49,000 that we have right now, or 40,900. Looking at the cell challenges, we've completed like quite a bit of them. The kill 100 players, we just did that one available in 22 hours. So we actually did that one like pretty recently, maybe like, I don't know, an hour and a half ago. We are on cooldown for that one. Obtain crystals also on cooldown. The only one, I think there's two of them that we actually haven't done yet. That is the capture the outpost one. And I've still never shown you guys the outpost. Oh my God, I feel so ashamed that I've never shown you guys it because it's like really, really cool. Uh, the artwork is amazing over there. The build is amazing. And you actually get a lot of rewards. Like, look at this. Two Vanity Crate keys for free. You get two Legendary keys for free. Four Titan boxes, which are the ones that I opened up last episode, which are really, really good. Another 100,000 tokens from that. Like, yo, we actually have to go ahead and start uh, out or capturing those outposts. But to start it, it actually costs 15,000 tokens, which is quite expensive. And then, uh, let's see. We've got the mining one, which, which we've also completed. So I think all we got to do is either the Envoy one or the uh, Capture the Outpost one but i feel like right now the best thing for us to do is probably just wait for the obtained crystals one because that one is actually super duper easy to do like all you got to do is basically just mine and like you'll eventually get uh the obtained crystals rewards so uh anyways guys i think that's gonna be it for this episode like we did the whole one minute challenge i kind of showed you guys you know if we were at the vanity plus mine and like if our pickaxe was kind of a little bit better we would have probably made 750 million but i think chia is starting to use the pickaxes right now and i guarantee you guys he makes at least 750 million dollars with that but but I think also if we were a little bit more efficient and like if the Vanity MC uh, backpack, you know, our full sign wasn't like messing up, we would have definitely made that much. But like I said, $660 million ish is not anything to laugh about. I'm pretty sure that's more than what Royal Cell has. And I definitely think it is not even close to what uh, Lord Elias' sell is doing. Like, these guys, I still think they're doing, like, $400 million a sell. So, you know, while we're making $160 million, these guys are literally, like, three times over what we have. But I do think that we are going to be beating Royal Cell this season. I don't want to jinx anything, but I do have a really strong feeling that I think we might be able to take one for the team. And uh, Dexter, Dexter's Dexter. So, you know what, if you guys want to go real for him in pity, like... Go for it. I don't think those guys are coming back anytime soon. But guys, that is going to be it for this episode. If you did enjoy, go ahead and drop a like down below. She has got a monthly crate April here. Hopefully you can get something good out of that. Maybe like some beacons or some dragon eggs. But yeah, that is going to be it. If you guys enjoy, go ahead and drop a like down below. Subscribe to the channel. If you guys are new, don't forget to click that notification bell. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.